Hi, my name is Kevin Gunn. I'm the manager for the Unity and Mirror teams and just wanted to take some time to give you an overview of what we had planned to do in the 1404 cycle as well as an update to what we've accomplished so far and what we've got left to do. So uh, as for the things that we were trying to focus on for this cycle, um, they're the following. Uh, Re-enabling side stage for our tablet form factors. Uh, we also wanted to split out the greeter from the shell. Uh, that'll help round out our security story. And then we also had um, a lot of um, feedback from our design teams, user experience testing, and um, specifically around the right edge navigation. So we, we needed to do some um, adjustments for that. Um, building out the dash toolkit is another item. And then adding in shell rotation support is another item. Um, leveraging uh, hardware com composition from the point of view of, of uh, Mir and exposing that up to the shell in order to do um, sort of non-GPU but accelerated composition. Um, another item that we wanted to do was to introduce a, a desktop preview of Unity 8 on Mir and that's going to depend on the split greeter work mentioned above as well as some other uh, Mir on Mir um, development. Um, and another item we wanted to do was to uh, add in uh, additional features and support for longer range uh, development around advanced window management. So, you know, non full screen, multi window type scenarios. Um, so, that, that, that rounds out the list of what we'd hope to achieve for 1404. Next, we'll look at um, what we've actually accomplished. So, for side stage, we've actually re enabled it, it's, it's actually on in the latest images. Um, but it is only functionally on par with what we had previously um, shown on Surface Flinger at this point. Um, as for the split greeter, we've got the bulk of the greeter work done and all the nested mirror functionality has recently been uh, debugged and updated and put into the archive recently. Um, <clears throat> as for the design updates around the right edge navigation, we've got an alpha branch of that available now. And um, on the Dash Toolkit, we've had great progress and we've got ongoing iteration activity with uh, the design team and that's shaping up well. Um, the uh, shell rotation support, so we've uh, completed the mirror part of that now. And then for the Unity 8 on mirror desktop experience, we've got um, all the graphics portion of that's done. So it's really about um, cleaning up you know, other areas of the, of the system. Um, so what, what what does that mean? What's left to do for 14.04? Well, for the uh, side stage, we still have to go back in and, and look at performance and try to address uh, some per performance aspects of that. And then the um, split greeter, as I said before, we've got um, the, uh, the bulk of the greeter work done, but we do still have to go back in and add in some uh, application interaction capability. So for instance, if you have an incoming call, the, the phone app's got to be able to um, give you some kind of notification that that's happening, even though it's locked. Um, as far as leveraging the non-GPU hardware composer layer inside of the the um, mobile um, form factor, um, that's something that we're that we've just begun to do, and and so that that there's a you know, significant amount of work there left for the the 1404 cycle. Um, for shell rotation support, as I said before, it's been added to Mir, but the shell side of things, it's something that we haven't even started yet. Um, for the um, desktop preview, as I said before, we just need to clean up the remaining pieces of the system and get that ready for public consumption. Um, and then as far as the um, work that we wanted to do around advanced window management, uh, we've done some early analysis and got some uh, I guess some some starter branches really around using QT scene graph and compositor. And then a new item on the list that, that we'll have to do this cycle is we're going to enable uh, the, the new Nexus 7 or the you know the generation 2 of Nexus 7. So um, you'll see that soon. And as far as things that might be deferred uh, until 1410, I think you know we 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 had hoped to get quite a bit done on the advanced window management work, but in all likelihood we'll probably have to push some significant portion of that off. Um, so at any rate, that about rounds up the, um, the update. So um, thanks for listening.